All right, coming up next, it is the UFC Heavyweight Championship of the World between the last style bender, Israel Adesanya and Sean O'Malley. Well, scary to think that Sugar Sean O'Malley is just getting started because the Sugar Show is most definitely a thing here in 2018. And O'Malley has lived up to the hype every step of the way. There was a lot of fanfare when he came on to Dana White's Tuesday Night Contender Series. And he has yet to slip up in a couple of UFC appearances. He's got every skill in the book. Still a developing fighter in a lot of respects. But this is a special striker and a fighter who likes to put on a show for the fans. As he makes his way towards the cage, his preparation has been perfect. He is in fantastic shape, had an amazing camp, and he believes that he is in the perfect position to become the new champion of the world. As he steps into the octagon right now, he steps in with a champion's mindset. Well, a lot of people think it's the most significant title in combat sports. No argument from me. Baddest man on the planet, UFC heavyweight champion. There he is in the flesh. What an absolute monster. What a title reign it has been. But a serious challenge in front of him here tonight. When this man became the heavyweight champion, a lot of people thought that this challenger was the one who would wrest the belt away. Now the fight is here. We'll see if we get a new champion or if this man continues one of the greatest heavyweight legacies the Octagon has ever seen. The champion is in focus right now. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this bout has been perfect. Everything ran according to plan. He believes he has a solid game plan, and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. And now let's get you our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. So a more than five-year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. All right, now to get us started with the introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 10 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Glendale, Arizona, USA, presenting the challenger, Sugar Shaw. And now, if you see the champion fighting out of the red corner, this man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 15 wins, no losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Israel, the last. All right, this is for the championship. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down right now. All right, here we go. Up for grabs tonight, the title of baddest man on the planet as we get set to crown a UFC heavyweight champion. Right left combo by O'Malley. Oh, beautiful, beautiful right hand by the champion. Adesanya gets hit with a kick. He appears largely unfazed, but he doesn't want to take too many more of those, Joe. Caught him with a punch. 
Oh, O'Malley gets tagged by that kick. That can't feel real good, John. That was a quick takedown. Israel Adesanya gets back up. Oh! And that one certainly found the target. They're going after it quick here. Just missing on the high kick there. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defense. Oh, flying knee. And we got a fight on our hands. Oh, he is just teeing off here. Oh. Big kick, but miss. Oh, that head kick landed. Oh, very nice. Adesanya gets tagged by a oh. solid uppercut there. Man, he's got him hurt here. Head kick! Oh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by O'Malley. Oh, he's landed some good shots here. Beautiful body, body shot. shot there, too. Vicious combinations. Adesanya's kick attempt there blocks. There's a nice kick. Hooked to the head there by Sean O'Malley. Effective punch there by Adesanya. Two minutes have expired in our opening round. Oh, caught him there with the head kick. Oh, big shot. He's doing a really good job of timing these shots. Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Working on a single leg here. And there's the single leg. Well, he works hard to get up again oh, here, but he was hurt. Oh, Looking like he did start him a little bad. bit. He's hurt. He's hurt. Misses with the head kick. Oh, he lands a huge kick here. Tries some serious power in that kick, but misses. And now starting to snap off that jab. Sonya gets back up again. Steps forward with his right leg. Now he's in southpaw. Israel Adesanya gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. Huge uppercut misses. Adesanya gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You gotta do better defensively. Oh, is that a good knee to the body there by O'Malley? Nice shot. Well, Joe, you got to fault the strategy here. I'm not saying he bet on the opponent, but he's moving right into that straight punch and right into his opponent's striking range. He would be wise to get his head off of the center line and stop leaning in. He's doing an excellent job of mixing up his strikes. Here. There's a punch there, Joe. Oh! Good defense there. Joe, nice head movement there to slip that right hand. Good shots by the champion. Oh, nice overhand left, Joe. Oh! This could be it right here. Went for the head kick. Well, he has stayed technical, but he is really starting to chew up the opposition now. He came out super aggressive, as aggressive really as we've ever seen him in the UFC, and now starting to uptick the volume again. Nice start here in round one. How about that shin? 30 seconds now to go in round one. Wow! Whoa! This could be it. Well, he gets up again here, but he looks hurt. Fifteen seconds wow. to go. Whoa. Beautiful knockout for the KO victory as the round was ending. Wow, Joe, just incredible. Just when I thought I was going to start asking you about what adjustments they could make for the next round, we get the end of the fight. A huge shot to drop his opponent. The referee wisely jumps in to stop the action there. Near perfect execution on that fight ending sequence. Check it out again. Boom. 
So on the sport's biggest stage, he comes up large. The baddest man on the planet, the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, your winner and by knockout here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at four minutes, 46 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still. with the moniker of baddest man on the planet, and that is exactly the way he goes out. Congratulations to the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, your winner tonight by way of the KO, and that's a big man celebrating with his team right now. Enjoy it, boys. You maximize the moment tonight.